Welcome to another Hunter One production. Graphic hunting situations ahead. Please leave now if you do not wish to view. I would like to thank B. Walton for tuning my new 30 cal to the tune of 930 feet per second, 84.5 foot pounds, 30 cal. This is a monster. This shot will be the only miss of the day. It's at 118 yards in winds of about 15 to 20 miles an hour. My windage holdover was a little bit off. Wish I could get that one back. Now this next shot was taken at a distance of 68 yards. I don't know what he was doing there, but I took a closer look through the scope. As you can see, the winds were pretty high, so I had to use a lot of windage holdover in order to uh, hit these shots. The 30 cal is really up to the task. I'm really loving this rifle. And there he is, rolling around. And here it is again, in slow motion and through the scope. Lights out. Out comes another one. These ground squirrels are very destructive, digging elaborate networks of tunnels that are very dangerous to livestock. A lot of people question why we take them. We take them for various reasons. This is one of them, in addition to them being full of diseases, including the bubonic plague. This guy popped up right at 54 yards. Now notice the holdover for windage. I almost could have held a little bit more to the right with the winds being so high, but the results are still the same. He was lights out. Here's another graphic shot taken at 54 yards. This one is also Here's that shot again through the scope cam. Now I have to warn you, 
this shot is extremely graphic. So if you do not want to watch, please turn off this video right now. This is probably one of the worst shots that I've ever taken on a ground squirrel. This 30 caliber is simply brutal. This shot was taken at a distance of 91 yards. The winds had died down just a little bit so I was a little bit more confident with this shot at such long range and the 30 cal did deliver. And here it is again in slow motion and through the scope cam. There's the pellet in flight. Lights out. Now this video would not be complete without me giving major thanks to my friend Baxter Walton for tuning my 30 caliber. This gun came from the factory shooting very well at about 840 to 870 for about 15 shots. After I sent it to Baxter and he did his work on it, this gun is shooting at 930 feet per second down to 907 feet per second for 85 foot-pounds for about 10 shots. Now, I can't express how happy I am with the performance of this rifle after I sent it to beat Walton. If you have a hat sign, I recommend strongly that you send it to this guy because he will have it shooting right for you. As always, thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Please click like and subscribe to be notified when new videos are uploaded.